Hello friends, welcome to Lug Life. These are some of the most fun videos to film. Yes, they are. Because what we're gonna do today is a <laughs> haul from our recent Disney Resort vacation, our Florida vacation. We got quite a few things on the trip. Yes, we, we know you guys love haul videos, so gosh <laughs> darn it, today, that's exactly what we're doing. This isn't all just necessarily Disney stuff. This isn't just resort stuff. This is stuff we got from our whole trip, some things that were given to mm -hmm. us. Um, and so we're just gonna kind of jump in, but there's not really a whole lot of rhyme or reason to this. Let's do it. The first thing we're gonna start with uh, are some things that were given to us. Yep. And now all of these things, confession, were given to us by uh, Sarah, Auburn, and Emma. Yep. That they, <laughs> they, they obviously, here's the thing. The biggest thing they gave us was the trip. The trip let's itself, be very right? <laughs> Let's be very honest that like the trip was the most amazing thing. Yes. But then they gave us other things as well. Yes, they did. So let's start, let's just start right here. This bag is so cute. This is like the Disney Christmas bag. Yep. It is so adorable. You can see it's got, um, tis the season, the Walt Disney World. Mm -hmm. And it's a nice size bag. Like it opens up really mm -hmm. well. There's a pocket inside. It's like zippers. It's, yep, it's really nice. Super cute. Now, Sherry, you got this bag. With something in it. With something in it. Yes. Now, confession, I just pulled this out of the washing machine. <laughs> because so Sherry has already been- a little been, wet. Sherry it, has already been wearing it. Because I, I was wearing it. Um, it's so comfortable. It's a spirit jersey. It's the winter spirit jersey. Amazing. Um, it has a little snowman with Mickey ears. The back has the castle. And it's and like- Look at this. It's like silver and gold. And this is like a- It's fluffy. Yeah, it's like, I don't know what this is, but it's like a really soft, like it's, I love this. It's so comfortable. Um, I, and it's got snowflakes. I just, in the castle, like I can't get over how pretty this is. I think it might've been the first night we were there, the second night we were there, yeah. that Sarah pulled the bag out with the spirit jersey and gave it to Sherry. Love so it. adorable. Actually, it was really cute because Sarah got uh, the holiday spirit jerseys for- Her uh, and Auburn and Emma, and then got me that one as well. So cute. All the girls got spirit jerseys. I did not get a spirit jersey. You did not. Because I am not, a, let's have this discussion. Let's just, let's have this talk right in the middle of our haul video. I am not a spirit jersey on guys fan. Right. I understand maybe, maybe some guys are out there rocking spirit jerseys. You do you, boo boo. I'm not gonna wear a spirit jersey. Right. Sarah, but, Sarah, thank you for not giving me a spirit jersey. But Sarah did get you something. Sarah did give me, she's always, ever since we've known her, <laughs> been generous to yes. us. Um, we were in line at World of Disney, yeah. like waiting in that long line. And uh, Sarah and Emma went over to like the Christmas store, I think it was. The co-op. The co-op, the co-op, mm -hmm. that's right. And texted this and I like... He was like, oh my gosh. It is, it's Baymax, <laughs> but it's Baymax in like a red and green Christmas scarf. Little earmuffs. And he has little <laughs> earmuffs on him. It's so cute. Stop. <laughs> like, look at this. I love that so, cute. so much. Uh, and then they <laughs> also, I, can't. <laughs> I know, they're so stinking cute. Uh, and then there's a couple other things that Auburn mm -hmm. gave us. Um, now, I knew that I was gonna get this. <laughs> it's a little gnome it's tree so ornament. Cute. Because when Auburn and I were at the reindeer farm, and that. it is fluffy, when Auburn and I were at the reindeer farm is when I bought, if you guys have watched the vlogs, it's when I bought that Christmas gnome, because I love Christmas gnomes. And Auburn was like, I have an ornament at home. Yeah. Would you want it? Yes. Can we talk about how his beard is actually longer than him? That's the way it should be. That's the way it should be. And then also this ornament, the little mushroom. Look at the little, look gnome, at the little gnome and the little mushroom. It's so cute. So the bag, the spirit jersey, yeah. the Baymax, the gnome, and the mushroom. And the trip. <laughs> and the trip, lest yeah. we forget how amazing that was. <laughs> uh, all gifts from them. Now, yeah. on to stuff that we purchased. Yes. Uh, next, I've already had several people ask me what ears I purchased on this trip. It's true. So we're gonna do this next. This pair I saw at World of Disney and I gasped audibly. It's true. I have not seen this pair before. Look at how pretty. It's like this kind of coral pink and it's got the, the rose gold crown. Like I love this. I'm looking at all of so Sh much. I'm looking at all of Sherry's other ears. And yeah, you don't have like that color is pretty unique. This color is unique to anything I have, and it I love the little crown on it. It's so pretty. So I had to buy this pair of ears. Naturally. Mm -hmm. But then you also bought two more pair of ears. But I did. I did not get these on Disney property though. Mm -hmm. You bought these at a weird place maybe to buy ears. Yeah. The antique store. The antique store. The Lakeland Antique Mall. There were a ton of ears. There were a lot, and these still Shocked. had the tags on them. Like these have never been worn. 
And so um, I love this color. Mm -hmm. I don't know what this color is, but it's really pretty. And the small world ears. Adorable. Look at how cute. So cute. And these were about $10 cheaper than you would spend in the store. Yeah. But yep. they're literally brand new. So yep. awesome. I was really excited. So three pairs of ears. Do you consider that a successful trip? I think it's a success, yes. The next thing we got is something I'm really excited about. And it's something that I didn't even know existed. Right. Sarah uh, came back to the bungalow. I think it was one night or maybe it was when we were out and said that she was at the gift shop in the bungalow and noticed that they had... At the Polynesian. Or at the Polynesian. Uh, mm -hmm. Noticed that they had the Disney wine available. And I was like, my ears perked up like... I'm sorry, what? what? Did you say Disney wine? <laughs> so they have this once upon a vine. So I cute. didn't know it was a thing. I and so know. I was like, all right, I need, before we leave, I need to go look at this. Mm -hmm. And so I think it was on the last day or maybe the second to last day, I went and I was looking at the wine they had available there. And they had a few different kinds. Um, and I was thinking, okay, what bottles do I want to get and bring back home? Mm -hmm. And here's what I settled on. The once upon a vine enchanted woods bubbly. Now, here's the reason I got this. We have an idea for this. Well, our Christmas morning tradition yeah. is that we wake up, we kiss good morning, because yeah. we're in love, <laughs> um, and we, we, say Merry Christmas. we say Merry Christmas, but before we like dive into presents, we make mimosas. Mm -hmm. And we thought, you know what? What a great way to remember, like, not just the cool trip we just went on, but also even just like the friends that we made this year, right? Right. The fact that- um, Kind of cap off 2020. To cap off 2020 yeah. with this bottle of wine uh, or champagne making mimosas, yeah. to me felt perfect. So we brought back the Once Upon a Vine- Limited release. Limited release bubbly. It's also- It's got the little rose on it. Look how pretty. It's so pretty. And I think this was, this was only $17. That's amazing. It is amazing. So I was super happy yeah, with that one. I'm excited to try that. Me too. And sticking the theme with things we got at the Polynesian, mm -hmm. um, in one of the gift shops there, I found this sweatshirt and I immediately fell in love and I was just like, oh, it's going to be really expensive though, so never mind. But then I was looking at the tag and it was not expensive. It ended up being... $55. It was $54.99. And I was like, what? Yeah. So obviously I got it. And it was also cold there. You guys will remember. It, well, it was like 45 degrees. At nighttime. <laughs> and so you needed something a little bit warmer. I did. Uh, and this has a hood, which I love. Look at how cute this is. I'm going to have you help me yep. hold this up because across it, it says on the sleeve, well, Walt, Walt Disney, Disney World. World. Look how cute. <laughs> I love this and I basically wore it the whole rest of the trip. You did. It's a really good color on you as well. Um, there's no, as far as like, does it have pockets? No. Okay. There's no time. I do wish that it had like the front pocket. It the doesn't. The kangaroo pouch. Yeah. It doesn't have any pockets, but it was still very comfortable and very soft and And honestly, for warm. I felt like for a Disney price for like a sweat right. hoodie sweatshirt. I was honestly expecting the 80 to $90 range. Wow. I thought it was going to be like. The spirit jerseys are eighty dollars. The spirit jerseys are eighty dollars. Mm -hmm. They're eighty dollars. Yeah. The spirit jerseys are eighty dollars. Wow. We'll have this discussion after the video. At least the Not Christmas really. ones were. That's crazy. I didn't so know that. So I was expecting the sweatshirt to be at least that. Wow. So fifty four ninety nine. What really, a deal. That was really exciting. <laughs> when you consider the eighty dollar spirit jerseys. I didn't buy any of this trip. You think if Disney was charging $80 for spare jerseys, they could paint the monorail so it didn't look so janky. Sorry, we're not talking about that this trip, though. We're not talking about that this video. Um, now <laughs> let's jump into something else that we got. Um, can I show this? Yeah. Okay, this was something that Sherry spotted. And uh, I, we were getting ready to leave Animal Kingdom Lodge, and she was like, come, I want to show you something. I need to show you this in a gift shop. And so we walked in, and... Uh, we both really fell in love with this. We showed it on the vlog. A lot of you guys will will already know what this is. Maybe you wondered if we got it or not. I love this. It's the giraffe, the zebra, the cheetah, and the elephant. And the and wood. And it says on it, hand carved by the craftsmen of Kenya made in Kenya. I think that's so cool. I love that. And I love this. We already know where we're going to put it in our house. Yep. Um, there's a Christmas decoration there right now, so we'll have to wait until that comes down. But yep. I love this and it's really lightweight like it's not really heavy it's just so pretty it's going right outside just so you know going right outside of auburn's room it is which is kind of perfect because this is a trip that happened because of her and the family yep. and so it's yep. like it's sort of like the it's sort of like the welcome to the auburn human suite <laughs> sign also i felt the price on this was really good it was it was 
$32.95. $32.95 for something made in Kenya. Right. Like from Disney. Like obviously hand carved. Did you just pull it apart? I just pulled this apart. I'm a moron. <laughs> I just pulled like one of the strings uh, okay. out of it. Well, we can fix that. We but totally can. I loved this so much. And I was like, I have to show this to Adam and try to convince him to let me buy it. And we <laughs> bought it. <laughs> the next things we're going to show are the things we bought at the antique store. Aside from the ears because you already saw those. Now, I do have to tell you guys something. If you watch the Antique Soar vlog, um, there is a part of this story that you guys did not get to see. <laughs> right. When we were at the Antique Store, we picked up a Mickey tree topper that we fell in love with. Yeah. Absolutely. We were like, this is perfect. Fell in love with. Mm -hmm. and, and then, then what happened to Adam? And then we left the store. <laughs> and it was hours later that day, we were talking about going to the store, and Sherry and I, almost at the same time, have the realization, Wait, where's the tree, the tree topper? topper? Wait, where's the tree topper? <laughs> Moron over here <laughs> set it down in to the store to look at something else. Now, I, oh, you saw in the vlog the size of this store. Huge. Huge. Aisles after aisles after aisles and just stuff everywhere. And so part of me was just like... It's gone. It's gone. There's no like, way. We are never going to find this again if somebody else didn't already pick it up and buy it. Totally. But then Sarah and Auburn, so gracious, were like, let's go back and look. Let's just look. And so we went back like the next day um, to the Lakeland Antique Mall, which you so guys did Adam not see. Adam starts going up and down the aisles and he's just like, I, I have an idea of where it was when we maybe. And so he was just like. <laughs> trying to find it. And we did eventually find where I set it down. You guys, we love this Mickey tree topper so much. You know our Disney tree, right? It's a smaller Disney tree. It's small. I can't handle like the big tree toppers. And that's all we've been able to find is these ginormous things. And <sighs> they didn't look good on this tiny little tree. And one of the coolest things about this, Sherry, can we yeah. plug Mr. Mouse in? I don't know how old this is. I don't know when it would be from. <laughs> it's spectacular though. Do you want me to do a Clark W. Griswold like countdown? No, just. Oh. I don't know if he's really going to show Oh, it's showing up a little bit on the camera. Yes, it is. He lights up. He lights up. He's holding light. Like, what? it's so cute. Like, this is perfect for our Disney tree. And one of the reasons that we wanted to film this haul video so <laughs> fast is that we wanted to get this on top of the tree. Yes! Like, look at how adorable it he's is. He's so cute. He's got his little bag. His And he's, like, ceramic porcelain. And I'm only moderately concerned about the fact that this is older and there could be electrical issues. We'll be fine, I'm we're sure. Gonna, we're gonna make it work anyway. We're just gonna and pray honestly, like safety. even if we don't plug it in, he's still adorable and Love he's him. still going on top of the tree. In fact, we didn't even try to plug him in at the store because to us it didn't even matter if I know, he they're worked. like, we can make sure he works and it's like I don't care. I'm buying it no matter what, <laughs> don't waste your time. Like yeah. if it doesn't work, we're still buying it. So, so cute. So we got the Mickey uh tree topper, but it did we did have to go back a second time to get it. Yes, we we actually when we went back a second time, there was another item that actually Auburn found. You guys, we actually have. We have a few of these. A few of these, and I love them. But we don't have this one. It still has the sticker in it, but um, <sighs> we don't have this one. And it's got like the Animal Kingdom like Mickey guide on there. And, and it says Animal Kingdom over here. So these are from Walt Disney World in the year 2000. Yeah. And I from these McDonald's. from McDonald's. How many of you guys remember the glasses from McDonald's? For Disney. Yeah. We have a bunch of these that we found at different like stores. Different antique stores. We just get like one at a time here and there. And so Auburn found this and she was like, hey, come here. She's like, I don't think you guys have this one. I was like, no, we don't. No, we don't. So we and so it. now we do. This was $8.95 for that one. Just, you know, the Mickey tree topper. Uh, I like to give you guys prices. I think $24.95. $24 I actually was stoked with that price. I was excited about that because the other, we did see other Disney tree toppers that were way too big. And they were like sixty dollars. A lot more expensive. I was just like, we can make it work because right now we literally have a pair of Christmas ears true. on the top of our tree. We did get a few more things though, didn't we? We did. Let's start with these two things that kind of go together. Yep. So we did end up getting the gold castaway key bag, castaway we club. Did yeah. So <sighs> we we saw the silver ones first, and we were like, that's cute. And actually, the castaway club. Um, bag like not like this but like this shape the tote we had and spilled uh, like a bottle of NyQuil I think opened and it in stained our, it and it, yeah opened in our suitcase and stained the bag and we could not get it out so we threw it away so we've been wanting to replace it and we finally did we did because you guys know if you've cruised DCL Disney Cruise Line has gone um, to like the sling I'm gonna put this down a little bit just because the colors oh, yeah, yeah. oh that's much better um, <laughs> 
Disney Cruise Line's gone to those like sling sling bags, mm -hmm. and we just hate them. I'm not a fan, and we have a bunch. <laughs> we do have a bunch. That's all they've given for the last six cruises we've been on. So, so love these. I'm excited for this. Yep, and we're gold members, so it kind of works out perfect. Yeah. But it was really cool because this so this was $20. And mm -hmm. at first we thought $20 for a bag, it's a little high, but it's something we don't have. It's Disney Cruise. Right. Let's buy it. But inside... But I was like, oh, there's something in it. And I was like, oh, no, we need to take this out. But on the tag, it says, with photo album. What? It comes with the photo album. Okay, I was it. just going to say, I haven't even opened this no, to, to see what this is. And I was like, wait a second, it's $20 for this photo album and the bag? Is this something Disney used to do, is give you a bag and a photo album? What is I this? Guess maybe. Look at this. It's got, we, okay, your name, map your voyage. Your cruise ship, your destinations. We, okay, we have not even opened this. <laughs> this is really cool. And, and then, then just like the blank pages of, for, for photos. Okay. This is really cool. And actually. place to like put notes. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Keepsakes. keepsakes. Okay. $20 for, for the, the bag, bag. And the photo album. And the photo album. Photo album brand new. The bag, I would say mostly brand new. Like, I think it's brand new. I don't I see mean, anything on it that says it's not. Right. So, so glad. We got those. Yes. We got one more thing at the antique store. Yes, we And this is something I'm actually really excited about. Um, we love to bring home a piece that to us is a memory of what we did on a trip. So sometimes we'll look for like an antique piece in an antique store. Sometimes we'll just, we'll look for one piece that to us is like the memory of the trip. Right. Um, Sorry, I'm just trying to our, move stuff. Our favorite part. Oh, Mickey's tipping. Oh, nice save. Wow. Fine. He's fine. fine. Mickey's fine. He's going to make it. Um, you guys know we showed a lot in the back section of the antique mall where they have all of the stuff from the resorts, from the parks. Crazy. Amazing section. Did we show this? I don't know. I actually don't think that we did. I don't know that we did or not. Um, they had these room trays. These are from the Polynesian Resort. Mm -hmm. It is that's like, actually one of the things I really appreciated about that whole back corner was that it it had tags on everything of where it came from around Disney. So what resort or what park yep. or what it was used for. Yep. I really appreciated that. So this is the piece. And actually, I'll even take this off and show um, that like the ice bucket, the coffee maker, the coffee cups, all that stuff in the Polynesian rooms mm -hmm. would sit on. And it's just like this really cool bamboo kind of tray. A tray. And it's got like... This kind of rubbery back, rubbery back, so it won't slip and slide all and, over the place. And so, what we decided we're going to do is we are going to put this right on our coffee table. Yep. And right in the middle of our living room, we have this amazing memory of this truly, truly spectacular trip to the Polynesian yes. with a piece that came from, from the resort Polynesia. we stayed at. I know, I love it. That's the kind of stuff that we love. Yes. So those are the things we bought at Lakeland Antique Mall and honestly could not be happier. So excited. We do have a few more things though. I think you yes, guys are going to be excited to see. And these are just kind of some of these smaller trinkety kind of things yeah but things that we kind of always get that we always get aside from one thing aside from one thing what do we not always get and this probably oh yeah aside from two things two things um <laughs> so we'll start with one of those things mm -hmm. this is a disney parks postcard pack now i got this for a specific reason and i'm not going to tell why i got this because said person may be watching <laughs> but wanted a pack of disney parks postcards yes the next thing, maybe one of the things that I'm the most excited about. He was so excited. He was like, Sherry, you have to go see this. You guys, it is the Mickey Waffle <laughs> Magnet for our fridge. It's going on our fridge. It's absolutely going on our fridge. Yeah. Look how cute that is. It's, how? it's bigger than the Mickey Waffles, though. It is, it is bigger than the Mickey Waffles. <laughs> Which makes me laugh a little bit. I do like that they had Mickey Waffle um, magnets. If they would have had Tonga Toast magnets, I would have just thrown them on the trash. Sorry, I'm not going to throw more shade on this video. <laughs> but this... Uh, so awesome. So, so, so happy yeah. about that. Now, Sherry, let's talk about the things. Let's talk about pins and ornaments. Pins and ornaments. Because you guys know, Sherry, why do these things matter so much to us? So, for pins, we try to get a pin from every place we stay or go to. So, we have a pin from every park that we've been to. Mm -hmm. um, we've, we have pins for the rides we've done. We have pins for... Um, special occasion things that we've done, like we were there on Christmas Day, so we got the Christmas Day one. Mm -hmm. Like we got, we we try to get pins that signify In, our trip. Yeah, important parts of the trip. Right. So we didn't get pins from all the resorts we went to. No. Because we only stayed 
at one resort. Right, but we did get one pin from one we just visited and, and had drinks at because it was so pretty. We showed this in the vlog. <laughs> it's the Grand Floridian pin. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to hold it up and I don't know if it's going to work. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it. Maybe. Can you guys sort of see that? Kind of, I guess. You can kind of see it in the vlog. It is the Grand Floridian pin with the Enchanted Rose on it. And the reason we decided to get this one is that we did have drinks of the Enchanted Rose. Mm -hmm. And it was just a really cool experience. It uh, was a really cool experience. Auburn yeah. was there. Sarah was there. It was uh, just a really pretty room that we were in. Beautiful room. I just wanted to like live there. Yeah, it was really awesome. Again, we were in the library yeah. room, which was, as someone pointed out in one of the comments they said that was a very fitting room for auburn and for sherry to be in which it was yeah so we thought you know what let's get the grand floridian pin and then we also had to get a polynesian pin yes we because did. that's the resort we stayed in but we didn't get any polynesian pin did nope we? there were a couple different options right they kind of had just the traditional polynesian pins that you could mm -hmm. you could get but then i noticed in one of the glass cases they had these things and i originally thought they were ornaments yeah like he texted me and he was like this is the ornament they have is it cute do you like it i was like yes and then I was like, wait a second, that's a pin. <laughs> and so these are like the, uh, what do they call them? The Gingerbread Collection mm -hmm. Limited, Limited Edition. edition so this is the Polynesian Gingerbread Collection pin. Again, I hope it shows up kind of a little bit maybe. Right. It says Polynesian In Resort 2020. 2020. And what's cool is that it does open up and inside is Moana. It's Moana. Again. There's that. You can't really see it. But can't really see it. But that would be Moana. Trust us. We're not lying to you guys. It's really cute. It and is super cute. I love that it says Polynesian Resort and that it has the year. Those yes. are things that we try to to get. We specifically try to get ones with years on. And it's not always easy to find. It's not. I feel like it just should be, but it's really not. So I was really excited when he found this one. And I love that it's a Christmas ornament because we were there at Christmas. Christmas. Time. It's perfect. So all of the boxes are checked with I one agree. pin. Now what we have left are two ornaments. So this one is our Polynesian ornament. Also Polynesian. Because we had to, and you guys. And this is the little guy that's in the main lobby. So awesome. Or in the in the ceremonial house. Yep. And, and it lights up. Somehow, some way. Here. I'm not great with no, buttons. Let me do it. And there we go. Probably can't even see that at all. But mm -hmm. I promise you, it does. His it little, lights up. His little torches his little light up. His little light up. And it's really just cute. And it does say Polynesian Village Resort. Um, it does not have the year, but I'm just going to write the year on the bottom. And now every single year that we decorate our Christmas tree, we get to say, do you remember when we got to go to Florida and stay you know in the hold it up bungalows? Black sweater. Sure, I was, I was, oh, yeah, you can see I it. was giving a very eloquent. I know, go ahead. I mean, it was, people were moved. I bet there were some people almost in tears. Okay. Every year when we decorate, Sherry, I'm doing, I'm trying to, I'm <laughs> tears. Every year we decorate our tree and we pull out our little guy and we say, do you remember the year that we got to go stay in the bungalows of the Polynesian village with Auburn, with Sarah, and with Emma? Wasn't that amazing? Every year for the rest of our lives, we get to do that now. And he lights up. <laughs> and he lights up. It's a big deal to Sherry. Speaking of things that light up, let's go to the last ornament. You're a big, you're really excited about this one. I'm so excited about this one. We got this one at the Grand Floridian, Floridian as well. Sorry. Nailed or, it. <laughs> that one. Um, <laughs> and also because we, we did have drinks with the Enchanted Rose, but also because Beauty and the Beast is one of my very favorite movies. And it had the Enchanted Rose in its little glass case. And it lights and up. And it lights up. The rose lights up. I'm doing this against my black sweater again. You want, Stop. Do you want I, me to create a super no, moving? Okay. You really don't. But it has like the one little petal that fell. Like it's so pretty. I love that one. And I had to have it. You also did notice that it doesn't have to be an ornament. It doesn't have to be an ornament. You can you can probably just take this um, ribbon off and it's got like little grippies on the bottom so you can sit and it's not going to like slide everywhere. That would be a cool thing to have on our display wall. Yes, it would. In between Christmases. That's true. Right? Yep, except then we'd have to, well, we could just hang it behind. True. Look how perfect yeah. that is. But look how perfect. And I don't know if Sherry has mentioned this. But it lights it up. It lights up. <laughs> it lights up, you guys. Being a real jerk wig. <laughs> but look at how pretty the rose lights up. <laughs> Right now, if somebody at home is playing a lights up drinking game, sorry. Sorry, you're trash. Sorry, you're trash right now. 
Uh, but friends, that's the stuff that we got, that's what we got from our Disney trip. We had some things that were given to us uh, by friends, by family. Let's be very honest, by yes. family. Uh, we've got some champagne to not just remember a trip, but to remember our time with them yes. on Christmas morning. Uh, Sherry expanded her ear collection. I'm so excited. Which is a big I deal. Just, I'm just gonna... Oh, I have scissors over here. It's okay. Did she put, them, put one on? Uh, Look at that. I'm not going to put any on. Is that okay? You're not? I, I'm going sure? to pass. I consider that I'm going to pass. Mm -hmm. We got some items from Antique Store that we absolutely loved and we'll yes. go back to next time we're down there because it was spectacular. Oh, it was amazing. We finally found the tree topper we wanted for our Disney tree. We've been looking. <laughs> Years. And we finally found it. <laughs> we got some cool things from the resorts. Um, this just, it was such a good trip. Um, it was just so stinking much fun. And you guys are actually in tomorrow's video, we're gonna do like kind of a entire trip wrap up, trip review. Mm -hmm. We're gonna tell you all of our thoughts, uh, let you know the things that we loved the most, the yep. meals we loved the most, the drinks we loved the most. We're gonna what touch we on each resort we went to and each mode of transportation we used. Yep, so it's gonna be uh, kind of an in-depth review mm -hmm. of our thoughts on the trip. And again, remember, so much of this trip was so new to us. Yeah, we've, nev we've never done any We've this. never done Disney like this before. Right. So this was all very, very new to us. We've been talking mm -hmm. a lot about uh, what that experience was like. And in tomorrow's video, we're gonna share all of that with you, but we wanted to first share all of this stuff that we got yes. with you guys. Yes. I'm gonna go put this on our fridge. <laughs> And um, put this guy up on our tree. We're gonna put him up on the tree, and I'm so <laughs> so happy. He lights up. <laughs> oh my gosh! That is the theme of this video. And he lights up. Again, apologies to any of you playing the drinking game. Mm -hmm. Friends, we love you guys so much. Thanks for being part of our community. Thanks for following along um, on this entire Polynesian vlog series. Yep. Not just here on our channel, but also over on Auburn's channel. Yeah. Uh, it's been fun. We we watch every one of her videos. We read every one of the comments you guys leave over on her channel as well. <laughs> Keep that up. Keep that up. We love that you guys have been so encouraging and so supportive of her. Uh, and and again, this trip would not have been possible without no. without them. Right. And so, so again, a huge, huge thank you to, to them for making yeah. all of this stuff a reality. We would not have this amazing Mickey. No. Or this Mickey Waffle. Or these ears. Or those ears. We could go on forever about this stuff. Friends, we love you guys. <laughs> Thanks for being a part of our community. Hey, Sherry, what does Mickey do? He lights up. Bye, friends. We love you guys. We'll see you tomorrow.